Hi guys, this is the Spirit Manga 187 and I just received the Hearthstone beta key. Oh yeah. So I told you guys before I would play some uh, I would upload some content of Hearthstone very soon and the day has come that we received the key. So let's do some Hearthstone content. So you're starting off with a mage. Uh, I unlocked some other heroes as well. Uh, I still didn't have fight fought against these uh, four guys, but I'm going to play uh, against the hunter for now, just to show off the, the game. Uh, maybe you guys already played it uh, before this game, so if you have played it before and you know how it works, um, you can skip this video and wait for my next video, because in my next video I'm going to uh, play some online matches, and this is just, uh, I'm going to show a little bit of the difference between Shadow Era and Hearthstone itself. Uh, so here you're going to start your game. Uh, well, I can exchange some cards, and I'm just going to replace uh, this one over here. And it's a pretty nice card. It says three uh, mana or three resources gives you one card, and I just drew another wolf rider. So that's not too good. So this is the interface of the game. Uh, your opponent, all opponents has a special ability, and everyone gains one mana. Well, one resource it's just the same as a resource you gain one every turn so every turn you gain uh, one and then after that two uh, until ten, 10 resources I think 10 more so you can use your uh, hero ability uh, once every turn so here he has his hero power deal, deal damage to the enemy hero so that's to me and I have uh, a two mana cost uh, hero ability that deals one damage to any target, so an ally or an hero. So I just gained one uh, mana crystal here. I have uh, four cards in my hand. I have three allies uh, and one uh, spell that I cannot cast. So I just have to end turn here. So these cards have charge, it means they can attack immediately. It also says that. And, uh, this one has your other minions has plus one attack, so that's really nice. So I just drew uh, an ally here, a turn two drop, just like uh, Shadow Era. I think it's pretty important to almost every turn drop a card. Now I'm going to end turn. I also could have used my ability, but I'd rather have an ally in play instead of uh, using the ability. We have another. Uh, mana crystal here. What I'm going to play is the raid leader because it will give my uh, other ally plus one attack. And the big difference uh, with Shadow Hero is that if it attacks, so here it says it has two attack and two defense, and this one has three attack and two defense. So if I attack it, they both deal damage to each other. So that looks uh, a bit like magic together. Um, so we did our attack, we have no resources left, and we're going to end our turn now. So the style of the game is pretty nice, uh, but I think it's kind of heavy too. Because I run this on a MacBook Pro 2012 model, and it's kind of laggy sometimes. So he comes with some spells, and dealing some damage to my allies, and I draw another card. This card is also pretty nice, it says fear, 4 mana, transform, uh, yeah. so most of the times it's smart to uh, transform an opponent's ally to a 1-1 one, one sheep, so it's only at 1 attack, 1 defense. This one is pretty nice, uh, battle crisis when you summon it, yeah, it's there on the screen, uh, you can play it, uh, it does something when you play it from your hand, and this one gives a 1-1 one, one ally. So let's see what we are going to do here. Um, we have some charging allies, and we have some drawing card allies. I think I just want to get rid of um, this one over here. So destroying my opponent's allies looks like a little bit of a priority. Uh, just like Shadow Arrow, it's almost uh, always very important to uh, destroy your opponent's allies. So this one also has a special ability when it ended the play. Um, and it has taunt, so uh, if I want to attack him, uh, him or this ally, this ally, I have to attack this one first because it's taunting. And it gives a friendly beast plus two plus two. And I think it's permanently, not until the start of his next turn, but 
I don't know for sure. Um, so we are going to play this one. Because it has haste. Ah, yeah, I have to take this one first. So okay, it gives him time. I thought it was uh, a bit different. But okay, no problem. Uh, we are going to play this one. So we want to draw a card. And to enter. So here we have a very nice card, 4 mana, and it has taunt, and it's pretty big. So here he comes in my face again, I'm taking some damage, but I don't think it matters too much. Just want to get the board control back. Um, let's see, drop the cards. And I think I'm going to play... Well, that's a pretty, pretty bad situation, yeah? And then, uh, we're going to play this one, because he has to attack him then. And uh, this little frog, it makes a very nasty sound. And we are going to attack his hero. Then turn. So he has uh, lots of cards in his hand. He's going to deal me some more damage with his ability. And there comes more allies and more allies. So he has pretty much board control here. He's destroying one of my allies. And it's my turn. This is actually a pretty nice card. It deals 3 damage randomly. So let's hope for the best. There it goes. Damage done. And we are going to draw some cards. Here we have another spell, deal 1 damage to all minions and a new minion. What we're going to do is here sacrifice our allies and drop this one to destroy them both. And to, I also could have used my ability, but yeah, I'm still pretty new to this game, so uh, I have it now for an hour or something. The beta key, I immediately install it because I really wanted the beta key for a very long time. So here I used the, the sheep card, I just waited for it for the right opportunity. This 9-5 ally was pretty scary and now we have transformed it to a 1-1 one, one sheep. And we can play our raptor here and use our ability to finish off the sheep. And we're going to enter. So in some ways it looks a lot like uh, Shadow Hero, but in most ways it doesn't look at it at all. So there comes two more allies for him, and th these are pretty nice. They they give you a card and they're board present, so that's really nice. Um, well, we are going to play this big big guy and a raptor and then turn I haven't used my ability that much but yeah I do want to play an ally each turn if I have one there comes some more damage to my hero with the ability and three more damage taking me down to 14 well this is so stupid I played like four or five matches offline and the tutorial and I've won them all pretty easily. <laughs> and now he is on the. He's doing better. <laughs> um, yeah, well, I want to destroy his ally, so. And this looks like a very much of an overkill, but I don't want to take another 3 damage, especially not with this ability. And we play this one. Dealing in 3 damage and I'm too. And really, this was a really, really overkill, but, yeah. His ability is going to use this every turn, so I do not want to take any more damage. And I do not know if this, car, uh, this deck has any healing cards. So here comes an ally with taunt, I have to attack him first. And a river, oh, this is Croxlisk. 2-3 ally. Okay. Um, well, well. Let's see, we're going to finish off him. 
going to play another one. And we're going to fire him for one. The next turn I can get four damage. No especially. I always get two damage. So. Here comes another ally. Another crocolisk. And I have one for myself. I do want to take this out because I don't want to have any more damage in my face coming and I will go to use my ability here and then turn. So I hope it's because of the beta that it's still a bit laggy. Maybe you guys not notice it but in the uh, intro movie and some other things I really notice a little bit of lag. We turn it into a sheep again, use our ability to finish it off and get an ally. And we're going to hit him. He gets 15 now. now. I'm going to 6 there, to 6 health. Let's hope we really do something crappy. Uh, that's not really nice, but. So I'm at 5 health now. And no card, so I really need the top deck here. Let's finish off the 4. And give him some more damage. You just drag it to your opponent's uh, hero and drop it. Then you deal the damage. There comes another ability. Take me down to 3, and this is a win for me. So, this was a pretty hard game. I'm just gonna play this for fun. Give him one more damage and attack him. So I hope you really like this uh, match, uh, a little bit of uh, explanation about it, uh, my English is really bad so forgive me for that, I'm not from uh, native, English is not my native language, I'm from the Netherlands, but uh, yeah, you guys also watch my Shadow Era videos, so you know my English isn't very very good, but, yeah I hope you like this match, uh, do not forget to like, subscribe, comment and some more Hearthstone content is coming up soon. See you guys. Cheers.